We hear us talk about so many times how it takes a village, especially when you're dealing with type 1 diabetes, and it has taken a village to put on some great events. So hopefully one day we can get a cure. Megan Ritchie, our favorite saying, turn type 1 into type 9, and we you know, do so many events throughout the year. So let's say hello to Miss Megan Ritchie, who's over all of JDRF and making all the events so fun. And you got some friends to kind of help put some things together. We've got Christina Lowry with Premier Medical and Rachel Manfrey with the Greenville Triumph and then Gabrielle Mahler with the Greenville Triumph. So yeah. Megan, let's start with the JDRF and Triumph connection. What are we doing? Yeah, so last year, um, the Triumph and Premier Medical got together to host um, an event, a mm -hmm. soccer clinic for JDRF. So pretty much to raise awareness for JDRF and for type 1 diabetes. And we had so much fun that we're doing it again this year. Oh, really? Are you raising any money doing this? We're not. Actually, this is just a fun, fun family thing. community event. The fundraiser uh, is later. Right. Fundraiser is, right. is later. Yeah. So what kind of things will we be doing? Yeah, so we will be working with some players and the coaching staff. We'll um, feed the individuals a healthy meal. And then afterwards, we'll just play some games. I love that. I love that. And you know, um, Premier Medical, y'all are always a huge sponsor and, and help so much when it comes to everything type one. Why do y'all want to get involved? Yeah, so we're um, an advanced medical diagnostics laboratory, mm -hmm. and some of the tests that we have, um, they serve to provide solutions for diabetes patients. So um, we have a, a panel specifically for type one diabetes that helps with the management of that. Um, and so we just want to help to bring awareness to type 1 diabetes with JDRF. Well, yeah. who, who's invited? Are, are kids coming? Or? Uh, yeah, kids. Or, so where as is young it as be? four, it's going to be at Bob Jones uh -huh. um, Activity Center. And, and actually, we have just uh, recently gotten to capacity, but we have a wait list. Mm -hmm. um, and this is an annual event so far. So we also hope that um, if you can't get in this year, that you'll check it out next year. This means y'all got to be quicker on the registration because exactly. it's become a hot, exactly. a hot thing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But uh, after this, we're going to be walking. Yes. In November. Tell yes. us about the big so walk. So actually to raise walk, mm -hmm. uh, to raise money for yeah. the um, JDRF, we will have the walk on uh, November 13th downtown at Floor Field. So we're hoping to raise about $175,000 for mm -hmm. diabetes research. Um, and that, of course, is open to the community as well. So we hope everybody will come and, and check that out and actually raise funds um, to cure type 1. To cure type 1. And I love it when so many people come together because we always say, like, you, you can't do this on their own. Right. From, you know, the sweet mamas and dads that's helping with the type 1 yep. kids to everything. It takes a lot. And then, Christina, there's something cool that is happening on September 28th. Tell us about that. Yeah, so September 28th is a fun holiday. It's um, Women's Health and Fitness Day. And so to celebrate that, we've joined together with uh, the Triumph's sister team, um, the, the women's soccer uh, the team. Liberty. Down there, the Liberty. The yeah. Liberty. Yeah. And um, so we're doing a giveaway. We've also yes. partnered with yes. the uh, with Serenity Med Spa. Mm. And um, they're going to be giving away spa treatments and uh, some, gifts, some gifts from the Liberty. So people can just uh, register at the link just to celebrate that. And then the winners will be announced at the Serenity Med Spa Open House on the 29th. Because who doesn't want a little massage and all That's that? Right. So yeah. <laughs> I think Tell us a little more about the walk, though. That's interesting. Mm -hmm. Yes. Bring it to the field. Yeah, so it's an annual event, mm -hmm. um, and we're hoping to have close to about a thousand people come to walk. And um, again, it's a great time for those that are newly diagnosed to come out and um, see other families that are in the same boat. But well, yeah, we had yeah. a niece with type one, yeah. and uh, uh, maybe people don't know type two can be cured with a diet. I right. think but type, type one, one is something we don't have a cure for yet. We'll, we'll right. keep on fighting, Megan. Yeah. Ladies, exactly. thank y'all so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks, Megan.